Hello everyone, I'm back with another video and in today's video we're gonna be up against Nurek and Black Lotus and I will be with Ness. Alright, now of course before we start make sure to subscribe and turn on the notification to all notifications so you will not miss a single thing from my channel whether it be stream or videos premiering. Now of course, smash the like button guys, yeah, yay! All right, let's go ahead and do so. Start. <laughs> the Silk Road is the map. I will be at the bottom. My partner will be at the top. I will be the green and my partner is the blue. Let's go gather those containers. Okay, I got those two containers right there. Container right there. And a sky right here. Mm-hmm. Okay. I have like eight supply centers now or yeah eight supply center a bunker and my partner is gonna be roasted by those early units so look at those units right there they're actually outnumbering this bunker and just running past it and then there's like that one rocket tower miraculously growing on the land oh my goodness <laughs> whatever happened to animation okay and now my Cerberus is out and I'm gonna have to of course annihilate that one annoying rifleman right there going HQ level 4 and headed straight to vehicle factory level 3 special vehicle factory and so on now let's see the action here my partner is being ganged up by both the red and the yellow player let's see now more porcupines are coming uh, on the way to my partner's base my partner has level 3 vehicle factory, 1 special vehicle factory, and an avia factory. And also level 3 infantry for flame assault. Uh, okay, there was that. Oh my goodness, that one coyote. Look at the damage of that one coyote to my Cerberus. Oh man, look at those. Okay, helping out with the annihilation of those annoying infantry. Oh my goodness, and that <laughs> one shotting a coyote with the skill. Alright, so yeah, definitely needs a buff for Cerberus, you know. Cerberus needs buff. Needs buff. One shot coyote needs buff. Okay, there it goes. Yeah! Okay, my partner. Oh wow, what an appreciative partner. Thanking me after helping him defend. Okay, and so we move on back to my base. As you guys can see, I am actually going HQ level or yeah. Special Eagle Factory level 3 and that another vehicle factory will be upgraded and I mistakenly uh, built another power plant there That's why I have like 950 power which is ridiculous here on my end small mistake Okay, that one coyote will surely indeed um, Live to see another day. I instructed my partner to have a cyclone to scout the uh, red players base to see what he has Okay, and now again one of my uh, X facility will oh, actually my X facility will now be upgraded to have that juicy Solaris which are in need of buff. Ooh, yellow player is actually camping around this cliff, which is actually a very good idea. Which limits my movement to just the land and making it harder for me to go over the cliff. Okay, there's the there's this uh, one cyclone right there. I believe that cyclone is not upgraded. The view is so small and the, the movement speed is not that fast. Okay, now given the uh, lo given the factory's uh, status to level 3, both of them, which means that this HQ is already level 4 because at level 3 HQ, you can only have one level 3 vehicle factory. Yeah, that gave it away. Okay, that's a good scout still. Now, I wanted to scout here with my Cerberus. However, there was like that one dragonfly which detects it. Okay, now looking at my partner's base, he's going for a special vehicle factory. He has like three flamies right there, my man, flame boys. Okay, and now going back at my base, X facility level three, shield, Zeus, and another special vehicle factory, I believe. Yes, it is. Okay, and I just decided to, you know, just go inside the base of this yellow player with a gold scouting boost with the Cerberus. Oh, level 2 Avia Factory. However, there's no airfield and it's not spinning around. So basically, he's not up to something no good. Level 4 HQ and nothing really crazy just yet. Two vehicle factory, one special vehicle factory. 
So he pretty much has the same build as my partner does without the uh, airfield and so on. Ooh, the action takes right to my base. There's like two Jaguars around here and I'm gonna have to try and force fire at that Jaguar. Yeah, wee. Pew, 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 pew. And then of course this GCP will now retreat. Okay, I deactivated it by accident. Another shield popped out. More uh, units are gonna be popping out of my factory. There's one Zeus. Oh my goodness, I'm under attack from two fronts. From the red and the yellow. Oh. Okay, my partner is also without a shield just now being produced. He has like five Zeus right here. But I think that he's not, this red player is not going to risk his JCP army because it is badly bruised up. Meanwhile, looking at my uh, army composition around here, I'm going to have to micro the shield away from the Jaguar's range. And yeah, Solaris is now in production. Ooh, looking at it here, there's like one sweet vertex. Oh, those flamies are like, <laughs> wow. Roasting the Jaguar, man, good luck. Meanwhile, my Cerberus is around here from inside the enemy's base since at the beginning of the game. Oh my goodness, look at that Cerberus, man. Dealing that much damage to a vehicle factory. Hmm, juicy indeed. Okay, my partner is quite a bit of pinch right here. However, he has his Zeus and that ultra smart pathfinding of a uh, shield is not covering it. Okay, here it goes. I'm gonna have to try and move around here. Scouting, scouting, and scouting. Ooh, there's like that one JCP army right there. My partner is still dealing with the JCP army around here, which will retreat. And now I will have to, of course, destroy as many units as I can inside that fog. And uh, my Cerberus is low on health. Okay. Oh my goodness. There's like two chameleons now that is active right here. My Solaris is out. Let's see what's going to happen. Oh, I'm going to be under attack from two fronts again. Okay, so this guy right here is retreating in order to lure my army away from my base and attack from the side. Boom! Oh! <laughs> All Jaguars and Chameleons died. I believe they're badly bruised up to begin with, but that was a very solid hit. Okay, my partner is helping me out there from the side. However, there's not really that much to help with. And now, of course, I'm going to have to destroy everything here. So Cerberus jumped from the uh, from the top of the cliff right there. I don't know if that's the top of the cliff. I don't care. Okay, well, yeah, that's that. GG. Okay. Attacking from two sides. My partner is going to have to counterattack by placing his units above this cliff, which is a very, very good idea. And then just now, oh my goodness, that shield was used to reveal the Jaguars inside. <laughs> and then the shield lived to see another day because it's so useless. Oh man. Here goes. I'm going to have to try and counterattack this yellow player, which is trying to be annoying. My partner is also under attack right here. And then there's like that one Thor. Mm, I have to say that's a solid bombing, run as most of the Jaguars are inside this, uh, uh, this location right here. Okay. All right. And so. My dogs are like crying around. Oh my goodness, eat my dogs. Oh god. Ah, okay. Dog barking is gone. Alright, <laughs> let's continue. Okay, sorry about that. And here goes this guy right here. Those. Oh man. There's only like three Jaguars here. Four Jaguars now. Okay, my partner. Oh my goodness. Oh, managed to destroy the airfield and then there's like that one or two Jaguars right there and which will now retreat. My partner is still here and basically this is it for this yellow player. Oh my goodness, so imbalanced. So, so strong. Anyway, we're cleaning up the uh, yellow player's base here and again, the coordination with my partner is actually quite good. I have to commend him for that, man. Thank you, man. You imba. There it goes. All right. Well, fast forward a bit. Okay. Seraphim is now out. And my partner will head above this cliff right here in order to attack the red player from the side. Meanwhile, his army is right over here. 
being produced and I'll have my newly produced army go in the middle of the map and at the side okay let's see what's going on here tons of jaguars lying in wait from below the cliff okay and there goes that one tour bombed okay chameleon live okay so chameleon needs nerf again all right it needs uh nerf badly and oh my goodness lag imba lag laboratory once more okay my shield i believe will die i'm not sure but there's like a bunch of jaguars there and three jaguars on the side has been annihilated by my partner and at this point in time oh man an attack coming from there an attack from all angles of his base oh god this is the beginning of the end for this red player all right well if you have liked this video subscribe and smash the like button and yeah there's that juicy skill right there Ooh, man very juicy okay and bam passive skill very juicy <laughs> okay so yeah better subscribe turn on the notification to all notifications so you're not gonna miss an upload or stream from my channel and of course check out my previous videos as they contain tips and tricks that can actually help you win a battle likewise thank you for watching have yourself a great day and good luck with your battles Bye now. Yeah.